4.25 y tengo muchos, mucho tiempo, muchos días que no he grabado porque nos enfermamos, nos alcanzó el... No sé si quiero decir la palabra, pero nos alcanzó that little plague that's going around. I don't know if you can still hear it in my voice. Um, pero a mí, gracias a Dios, well, le dio a todo, everybody in my house, so like my husband and my two kids. Pero gracias a Dios que um, los niños casi no tuvieron nada. Literal, si no fuera porque los um, test, les hice el examen en la casa, nunca hubiera sabido que estaban positivos y luego um, yo y mi esposo fuimos los que nos enfermamos pero yo fui la que me enfermé más um, y ayer por fin salimos de cuarentena y um, a, a hoy, ahora es viernes y nos vamos de vacas um, we're taking a little road trip con mi hermana y su familia a San Diego and I'm gonna bring you guys along and you know como dije mi little diario de grabar um, estas vacaciones con mi familia y los niños <laughs> y el otro está Axel está dormido so yeah so um, come spend the weekend with us y a ver que hacemos uh, right now we're on our way over there um, y estamos como a dos horas fuimos a desayunar en la mañana pero no grabé eso so, ahorita vamos para allá y ya son las 12.41 41 41 41 12 41 cuando llegamos ahí Okay, so when you walk in, this is the first thing you see. Here's room number one. A very spacious. Matias, Matias, what are you doing? There's the restroom here. This is another room. Very nice. You come out. Here's the living room. <laughs> Here's the mirror, girl. Hi, Miss Girl. I'm Shelby. And Axel. And then here's the kitchen. The kitchen's way too little for the house, the size of the house. And then we got a little washer and dryer. It's okay. If you fall though, I don't want no crying. Here's another room. We have a little foosball table. Here is the other room. And this is the... Backyard, which is nice. We got the babies. Hi, babies. Hola. Hola. Hola, pajarita sin cola. I told you you took a smelly ass shit. <laughs> So here we are enjoying some of the backyard amenities. We have some chess. And then we have this, whatever this is to call. Nene! No, baby. Ah! No, Matias, don't do those. Those you play with.
Hey, Y'all want kids? This is your um, free birth control. So it is much later in the day. I'm right here with the two bebecitos. Come on, focus. Yes. Say hi, Axel. Say hi, Miss Girl. And we have the rest of the gang outside in the jacuzzi. Just the boys. I think I'm just gonna run out. Yeah, just let them cry. It's okay. Oh. No, I'm saying that they're no, not they're crying. not crying. They're playing. Oh, it took a long time to get them on there, but really, we have the rest of the gang out here. Is it is it warm in there? Yeah, it's so cold in here. It's really warm. Oh, uh, the water looks dusty, musty. <laughs> <laughs> if you could only eat one country's cuisine for the rest of your life, what would it be? It's not cuisine, it's cuisine. It's cuisine. <laughs> Italian food. I said Italian food too. Italian? You Italian guys are food. lying. Pasta, pizza, 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 and everything. Go read the next one. Do you sleep? Do you sleep in cuadrado, si o no? Do you sleep in do you sleep in cuadrado, si o no? No. No. Why or why not? Yeah, look. Why? Because this is why. Exhibit A. B. C. D. We got the whole alphabet. We got the whole alphabet. We got the whole alphabet. That's why no dormimos in cuadrados. You have to replace your hands with some other alphabet. What would it be? A hook. No. A tongue. Claws, yeah, claws. Tangas, digo What are you scratching? Nothing, somebody What's going on? Um, you are on a long flight and the child behind you is kicking your seat. What do you do? No, 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 no. No, no, no. My child is probably the one kicking the It's probably the two children. It's probably the two children I'm, kicking. I'm, I'm probably telling him to knock it off. Okay, not the next one. So you, are, you are on a date. Paying for dinner and your credit card is declined. What do you do? Oh, shit. <laughs> If it's before, you kick. Be like, I'll be right back. It's, if it's before, <laughs> if it's kick. If it's for what? Let's run for it. But yeah. if it's a date, I'll run back. Hold up. Uh, he said, if it's my wife, I'll say we're wrong, but if it's a date. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm ready, so my, my question will be me and you were just there. Oh, okay. Okay, muy bien. That's good. That when should I, have been your when I answer, answer, when I answer like that, a ver qué vas a decir, eh? What, what, what color makes you cringe? What color makes you what? I think French. Maybe. Burgundy. Burgundy. I was gonna say the same thing. I was gonna say burgundy too, but I didn't really like that. I think young. I bet go, you have. No, baby. What advice would you give yourself at age at the age of 15? What advice would you give yourself at the age of 15? At the age of 15? Let's see. I mean, this is a good one. I'll piensale bien, güey. Piensale bien. What's your words? When you sleep in the other room, there's four rooms in the house. Well, I'm trying to think what I was doing at age 15. Maybe slow down. Slow down? Yeah. I would say. I would tell myself to slow down, that there's still a whole life to live. Yeah. I try to live so fast that now at the age of whatever, it's just like What's life is boring. What's your age? I'm just kidding. 32? No, no, life is boring. No, a ver, a ver, a ver. Vamos a ver qué dice Ivan. Okay, invest in Bitcoin. Yeah. Invest in Bitcoin? <laughs> Okay, Brokey, tell me how much you was gonna invest in, in Bitcoin. <laughs> no way, I bet a serious one. That was serious? I don't know. I would say, uh, no, no. Stop just 
find your passion and just do it from the start. Okay. My answer would be now that I know what I like, uh, maybe go to school for that. At the age of 15? Yeah. <laughs> what do you mean? Like, follow your dreams, you mean? Like, yeah. follow your dreams. Like, why would you like it? School is good. Okay, let's see you smart ass, yeah, dumb ass. What's your, what's your <laughs> dumb ass advice to yourself? First of all, dumb ass. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Okay. 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 No, go. I didn't be careful. Yeah, no, you guys are not going to know what I would tell my 15 year old. Who peed in the shower? I heard. I told him this. Wait, he's awake, but he's not nice. Have you ever done something you regret? Yes. Belen. What? Belen. <laughs> Next question. What country would you least like to visit? You great, great. <laughs> What is one thing you'd change about yourself if you could? Like physically or like? As a person. Okay, go. You go, Bella. I think I would say. Um, I think two things. I think overthinking and like my irritability. I think I get irritated. Okay, you? Yeah? I would say. Maybe over. To get over, to get over my phobia, phobia of public speaking. Okay, good. Um, me, I'm perfect, so I'm good. No, I think it'd be um, self-control and <laughs> <laughs> self-control with like my, you know, whatever attitude, and then. I think I wish I had like a desire yeah. but to be more healthy like an eating. Or like having that fitness kind of like a little more of a driving fitness. Just drop your keys into a public toilet. Do you reach and get them? If they have my key fob for my truck or my car, yes. If not, no. The key fob? You can replace the key fob. Uh, but if you need to get into a car, how are you going to do that? I would and I'll count my losses. <laughs> That's disgusting. Yeah, I'd do it. I'd grab, like, I'd grab my hand in the, in the paper. I'd grab my hand in the paper. And what are you going to do after? Run them out after underwater? They probably don't even work at that point. Yeah. Okay. What animal does the person to your right remind you of? Um. I just think that thing. You know, the kids don't say monkeys. Damn. Never mind. <laughs> they better not think you're afraid of me. Violent monkeys. Chimpanzees <laughs> are those most successful. Yeah. Who would be the ideal age to have a first child? Oh my god, none. Don't okay. don't have none. Uh, I've had one at 18, 21, and 24. 24. 24. 24. 24. 24. 24. Wait, how old am I? <laughs> Yeah. Oh, okay. That's Wait, um, uh, how old was I? I think my, my age. No, there's no red age, honestly. There's no red age. No, okay. I know because I was older and I would say don't have kids. I, I think I think there's no right age. I think the most important thing you have to think about is who you're gonna have a kid with. Hey, I'm right here. Well, I have three of them. After one, I have more. So. No, I think for me personally, I think same partner. Age, maybe. No, that's why I'm saying that. I think that. Because that's, for me, personally, that's where I was. It's found the more stability. Yeah, more stability in, like, in most areas. So you would think there's a perfect thing? No, I don't think so. I beg to differ because we were stable and... We and had hard, and right? we had stability yeah. and we were older and it was still hard. But it right, didn't but, change but anything. The thing that counts the most is who you have the baby with. Yes. I think that that's what counts yeah. the most. Yes, of course. Febrero 26 and today we are going to the San Diego Zoo Safari. It's not the zoo because um hace like como tres años um atrás fuimos a la San Diego Zoo. Um I don't see that safari. Um and that is actually an escondido. So we are on our way over there. It is 9.50. It's a little bit later than we would have hoped for, 
Pero we ran into some technical difficulties. We woke up to a flat tire. And yeah, so that was not fun. Pero ya vamos para allá and I'm so excited. Abdel, are you so excited? Yeah. Yeah? What animal do you want to see? Um, the elephants. Are you excited, babe? for Axel because this will be his first time because three years ago Adiel was so little when we went to the safari and it was so so much fun aunque casi no se acuerda but the good thing is that we have videos and we have pictures of that so we're excited to make new memories and um, coming to San Diego or to Palm Springs is something that we do every single year but um, por lo de la pandemia no habíamos venido and we also do Big Bear every year for my mom's birthday. Uh, el año pasado no pudimos ir because I had a really rough pregnancy and it was really high risk. So I didn't go, I stayed behind and I'm really looking forward to that because that is two weeks away. So that's another awesome trip and it will be Axel's first time going. To Big Bear. <laughs> It'll be Axel's first time going to Big Bear. So it's exciting um, esta vez because you know we have another baby that we have added to our family and we are so excited to keep building these memories con ellos. And um, usually my mom viene con nosotros, like my mom, my sister, my stepdad, and my brother sometimes, but. Este año they couldn't, they stayed behind and so you know you guys have this video to look back at and be mad at the fact that you guys didn't come. But you know what I think um, anything that can make a memory with your kids is totally worth it because this is something that they remember forever and ever and even if they don't Tienen las fotos, tienen los videos to go back and that's something so awesome because when we went, um, we went a couple years ago to um, Los Cabos with Abdiel and although he was little, he was, how old was he, one? Yes. He was one year old, one year old, no sé, un año, tenía un año and although he doesn't remember, we went swimming with dolphins and everything and we have pictures and to him, it's like he, he cannot believe that he did that and it's so amazing to see them and to see like pictures and to see videos of them and I really think that it's awesome that we are able to give this to them and hopefully we have a lifetime to travel more and to, um, I don't know, give them more memories. So we'll keep you guys updated. Excited? Yeah! Okay guys, so this pretty much wraps up our um, day at the um, safari. It was um, so fun. What do you think? That was, that was awesome. Tiring, but cool. Yeah, it was definitely very exhausting, but I think it's totally worth it. Um, it's a good experience. Yes, I got a lot of little clips of like the animals and I think of like a, a, we went on a tram and um <clears throat> it was definitely fun um and 
it is a very exhausting so if you have kids just make sure that you are well obviously if you take your kids make sure you go well prepared um to walk a lot and go up a lot of hills and stuff like that but overall i think it was a 10 out of 10 experience um however i am gonna say that i think it's very similar to no it's out huh? Yes, and then I want to say no that it's similar to the zoo, but I don't I think what makes it different is the little houses that you can go into and Like the birds are flying on top of you and they fly low low like They freaking fly like right over your head like they have no respect um, and also like uh, There's a bunch of like what are they like ducks? They're ducks. They're like geese They're like um, a bunch of goose, gooses, ducks, everything walking around. So that's pretty awesome to see. Um, but I definitely do think that it was a fun experience. Abdel, did you have fun? Yeah. Yeah? Would you come again? Yeah. Did you get to see the elephants? Yeah. Yeah? What was your favorite thing? The, 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 Soda? The, uh, almost the, the elephant. The animal animals, elephant. the elephants? Yeah. Yeah, it was very awesome. Axel had a great time too. He um, enjoyed it, I think. Um, but the sun is very draining. But overall, it was a great experience. And it's still early enough. It is um, about to be 5 p.m. So we were there for a while. Um, and now we're heading back to the Airbnb. So let's see what the rest of the day has for us um i think for me nothing just relaxing but i think the boys are gonna do um the hot tub and maybe me and my sister clean because tomorrow is um checkout. checkout day but it was a a cool little staycation huh yeah. um so that's it for now. Okay, so it's many, many days after our trip to the safari, but we wanted to hop on and say thank you so much for um, watching this video. If you stayed all the way through, and if not, um, but we um, will be recording more videos. We have an upcoming trip, and we are going to Big Bear. Yes. Yeah. For my mom's birthday, that is a little bit of a longer trip. We are leaving on a Thursday and coming back on a Sunday. Um, so we have that. And other than that, um, we will post more videos as things we do. Um, on Sunday when we got back, um, the safari, we actually... Um, have bought the kids a trampoline cuando estamos en cuarentena, you know, because desperate times call for desperate measures, and the kids who were going through it. So, um, we had actually gotten, um, like a zebo and a trampoline to kind of like make the quarantine go a little bit easier. Yeah, on the camera, no, I never showed, but um, yeah, we'll show you guys next time we're outside. But we never got to set it up because. Um, it was raining, cold, windy. Uh huh. So and we, aparte de eso, we were sick, so we didn't want to go outside and get even worse. So we kind of left it, and then on Sunday when we came back, we kind of just like upgraded our backyard. We put up the trampoline and we put up a gazebo, and um, that was the end of that weekend. Um, so once we are outside, I mean not today not when this video goes up you will see um because it's super windy again um the weather has been crazy last week it was like super hot and then it was raining and then today's super windy Acá cuando agarra el viento, agarra bien y bonito. Like, so yeah so today will not be the day that you will see the backyard but you will see it in another video um hopefully soon 
so yeah thank you so much for watching and until the next video peace adios